We a r e bears merry Christmas. It was a peaceful Christmas Eve night. We a r e bear hung red socks in front of the fireplace. Way down on the bed, we are very close her eyes and pretended to be asleep. She decided to wait for Santa Claus. The night felt too long. A bright form lit up the window. What gift do you like to receive? We are very asked the moon. I've been waiting for a long time. I especially wanted it to be a lucky moon that brightens Christmas night. Look at me! I became a lucky moon. I'm a full moon. The moon replied with joy. Ria Bear couldn't sleep. She got up, put on the green cloak, and lay down on the bed. When Santa Claus comes, I'll be able to get all right away. The bed was soft. Leah Bear's eyelids became heavy, and soon she fell asleep. Leah Bear went to dreamland. A gigantic star stopped above the stars and shone a light. Baby Jesus was born. We are bear became an angel and blew the trumpet. Santa Claus had a live in the forest village. Santa Claus meets the caterpillars who welcome Christmas for the first time on a silent Christmas Eve night. Everyone fell asleep. Someone called the wee bear's name and woke her up. She got up, rubbing her eyes. Mom, where are you? Ho ho ho! Are you a wee bear? Are you Santa Claus? The Abel almost screamed with joy. Sure, I'm Nicholas of Santa Claus. Santa Grandpa, did you read my letter? Absolutely. Merry Christmas, Sir Abel. Santa Claus is here. Is this just present to you, Anidit? Thank you so much, Santa Grandpa. Come on, hurry up and get ready. We will be busy giving gifts to children. The other girl kicking her blanket. She opened the door to leave her house. We are both. Let's go to the chimney. <laughs> My sled is on the roof. Oh, I see, Santa Grandpa. See you soon.